My name is Eddie Garcia. I'm from the Low East Side. Born and raised. Well, right now I'm on the show called How to Make It in America with Luis Guzman, uh, Eddie K. Thomas, Victor Rasu, Brian Greenberg. You know, beautiful cast, beautiful people. You know, uh, Ian Edelman, Julian Farino, uh, Steve Levinson. You know, uh, these guys all involved. And, you know, they're the same people who uh, did Entourage, Mohawk Empire. You know, I mean, great guys. It's like a big family there, you know. Enjoy, enjoying myself, having a lot of fun. It's funny, I play myself. My name is Eddie, and that's the character that I play. So, you know, it's pretty ironic, you know. But uh, it's a lot of fun, you know, enjoying it, having a good time. It's so easy playing yourself. <laughs> it's, uh, it's, it's something that I love, you know, something that I enjoy doing. And they always say in life, you know, uh, the best thing is to do something that you love, that you enjoy, you know. Uh, you know, I worked for the city, you know, over 20 years, over 21 years, and you know, I had good moments, but I had I had my bad moments too. You know, it's it's, it's a hard job. It's you know uh, a lot of a lot of red tape, a lot of propaganda. You know, a lot of uh, uh, unnecessary stuff that you deal with. You know, and you know it's it's not it's not my love. You know, it's just a job. You know, that's all that was. You know, but when it comes to acting, it's something that I love and I really enjoy it. You know, and I think that's what everyone should do. You know, if you're going to, you know, work at something for 15, 20, 25 years, whatever it is, and you're going to make it a career, make sure that you love doing it. You know, it makes all the difference in the world. Luis Guzman, <laughs> uh, to me, Luis Guzman is, is the low east side. <laughs> that's the man, you know. Um, you know, he's, he's, uh, he's a man of, you know, many talents, you know, uh, Man with a big heart, big family man, you know. Uh, a great, a great artist, a great actor, you know. I mean, um, you know, the, the man is multifaceted. You know, what can I say about him? You know, I mean, um, you know, I've known Louis since the '70s. You know, we go way back. You know, we were in a theater group together called Teatro Ambulante. You know, uh, which was. Uh, it was it, it was it was a, a a neighborhood theater group, and we we had a lot of fun there, you know. And uh, Louis, you know, pursued his acting career, and you know, God God you know God bless him, you know, he's done wonderful things. And you know, I did it for fun, you know, and I enjoyed it, you know, I had a good time doing it. But um, you know, Luis Guzman was a man that always you know uh, told me, hey Eddie man, you know, go out there and do your thing, you know. You know, he used to always invite me, you know, to places, you know, to different theater events and stuff like that. And, you know, um, he, you know he, he really pushed me, a, a mentor, you know, a brother, you know, someone I love, someone that I look up to, you know. I mean, um, you know, the, the man is, is, he was an activist here, is an activist. You know, he does so much, you know, people know Louis Guzman, the actor, but they don't know Louis Guzman, the man, you know. Like I said, you know. You know, he's a husband, he's a father, he's a son, you know, he's an uncle, you know, he's a, he's a friend, you know, he's a brother, you know, he's he's a, he's a lot of things, you know, not only an actor, you know, he gives a lot of himself, you know, to his neighborhood, to his community, to his people, you know, he shows everyone love, he shows the community love, shows the people love, you know, uh, you know, his boost mind is just, you know, he's always maintained his humanity, you know, his heart, you know, his human nature, you know, he never lost track of who he is, you know, and that's who Luis Guzman is, you know. It was a blast, I mean, you know, Luis is a fun guy to work with, he's a professional, you know, perfectionist, you know, so whenever he sees you, that you know, you're not in character, you're not doing the right thing in the scene, you know, he gets on you, you know, he gets on you and, you know, you know, it's for a reason, you know. He, um, like I said, he's a perfectionist. He's a professional, and uh, that's why Luis Guzman's been in the business for so long. You know, because he loves what he does. You know, he takes it serious. He takes it to heart. You know, it's his life. Well, you know? working on a book. Um, the book is finished right now. Um, it's just being edited. We have people looking at it. It's about the Lower East Side. It's called Lower East Side Do or Die, and it's about um, life in the LES. 
you know, back in the 70s, 80s, you know, into the early 90s. And uh, it's an untold, you know, to me it's an untold story. Um, you know, when the crack epidemic hit, the AIDS epidemic hit, you know, uh, there was a, there were a lot of people, you know, a lot of young people, a lot of young Latinos, a lot of uh, minorities, you know, in general who, uh, you know, who succumb, you know, and end up dying. And uh, let me tell you, a whole generation was wiped out, but you don't hear about that. And so, you know, I want to I wanna speak about that and other things, you know, that took place back in those days. Wow, I mean, it's a big list. It's a, it's a big list of people that I would love to work with. But, uh, you know, besides Louis Guzman, of course, you know, uh, you know, I, I like Wayne Johnson. He's, you know, he's an awesome, awesome actor. Seems like an awesome human being, you know. Uh, love Jackie Chan, you know. He's, uh, you know, he's, he's been one of the, you know, the actors who's been out there for a long time and someone that I enjoy watching, you know. I mean, so many actors, you know. I mean, uh, you know, I, to me it's just an honor working with, you know, with, with, with anyone out there, you know. Um, I just really enjoy the, I, I enjoy acting, and I, I love it, it's a lot of fun. And, um, you know, I just look forward to what the future holds for me. That's it.